It's expected to vote on a plan to solve a transportation dilemma. Its members, which include all county commissioners, will vote on a plan for a modernized bus system or keep pushing for an extension of the Metro Rail in South Miami-Dade. CBS 4's Gary Nelson is live in downtown Miami where a meeting is underway. Gary. Well, the future of public transportation in Miami-Dade County, by all accounts, will be shaped in this meeting here today. The issue is, will Mayor Carlos Jimenez succeed in his plan for eventually a countywide rapid bus system, or will those who favor Metro Rail, Metro Rail they believe they were promised, uh, prevail instead? Miami-Dade commissioners and community leaders sitting as the transportation planning organization deciding whether to approve a quarter billion dollar rapid bus system from Dadeland Metro Rail to Florida City. Mayor Carlos Jimenez is pushing the fast buses plan over a more expensive expansion of Metro Rail. Which is just like a train. You get on like a train. Uh, you, you prepay like a train. The gates go down like a train. It's just as fast as a train except it's got rubber tires. And the mayor says time is critical in order to meet a deadline next week for matching federal money. It's a decision that needs to be made because we need to move. We need to get something done. Critics, including many city mayors and county commissioners, say buses won't do. People won't use them, but they will catch a one-seat ride on a train. So many more people will ride. So many more cars will be left at home or in the park and ride. And citizens imposed a half cent sales tax on themselves 16 years ago with a clear expectation rail would be the future. People were told, they voted, they were promised, they expected, they paid, and yes, we need to deliver. Little of the billions raised by the sales tax has been used to expand transit, but rather on operating an existing dysfunctional system. Now, if Carlos Jimenez's so-called smart plan system is approved, it would eventually see six uh, rapid bus lines extending to all corners of the county. The last time this was considered, they decided not to decide. The meeting went on for hours on end. This one should be shorter because public comment has been limited. We'll see what they decide, if they decide, and have that for you coming up on CBS 4 News later today. We're live in Miami. Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News.